This was a, um, a minimum wage that was promulgated in March 2003 in South Africa for agricultural workers only. Uh, and what we tried to do was to estimate the impact of the law on employment, on wages, uh, on one non-wage benefit, namely uh, the provision of a written contract and uh, hours of work. Um, and because we have data over that full period, pre and post the minimum wage, uh, we were able to estimate some of the effects on those variables. So what we found was that uh, employment uh, falls significantly. So on the descriptive evidence, uh, farm worker employment immediately after the promulgation of the law declines by about 200,000 workers. Um, it's about a 17% decline. Um, and in addition, wages though do go up by upward of 20% on average um, across the country. Um, we find that uh, what we call at the intensive margins, so in terms of hours of work, employers are not adjusting. So they haven't uh, tried to reduce hours of work uh, and retain the workforce, which is sometimes found in other studies. Um, but as a, as a non-worker, a uh, non-wage benefit, what you do find is that um, employers are now offering a written contract um, increasingly, uh, likely to do so in, in, the, um, in the sort of, uh, uh, in the advent of the minimum wage.